Welcome back, my cannonballs. We're back for a short, quick second. And I mean short. So, I have seen videos and videos and videos and videos and videos and videos and videos, and videos about people talking about the beef sector. The beef sector ain't doing nothing nobody else haven't already done before. It amazes me how people, black people to be exact, the main ones, they want to talk about a, partic a particular se sector, but they have turned around and did the exact same damn thing in their sector. Mm-hmm. And my thing is, I am so tired of people using, you know, oh, it's the section aid and, and this and that. Let me just say it like this. Ain't no fucking soul on this earth is better or greater than anybody on here. Okay? It don't matter what type of car you drive. No, no, no matter the type, what, no, the type of, you know, it doesn't matter what type of um, house you have. You may live in. The type of job. Clothes. It ain't nobody better than nobody on this earth. It just amazes me how people can just try to pass judgment on their own people. You know, as if they are just too good to cuss a person out or say something ignorant. This miss me with the BS. This miss me with the BS. And then you know what? My thing is, if the beef sector wasn't, if the beef sector wasn't so big, why do one of us got to put the beef sector, beef, the beef sector in titles? Huh? For clicks and views. For clicks and views. Riding off the backs of the popular names, or what? Better, look, better yet, riding off the riding off one person back that is popular for the moment. I never understood it, and I still won't understand it. But you know what? These, these are these in my eyes. These are just another. Highbrow, I think I'm better than the next type of people walking around here. And you're not. Your shit smells just like everybody else's shit smells. Mm -hmm, it does. And you know, it's, it's, it's just, and you know what? It's another individual out here that I just cannot too much, I don't too much care for. Like, I think that person may be struggling with their sexuality since they have so much to say about everybody else. Mm -hmm. Boy, you, you look, give this person a few, um, get a few bottles. And you will see Sister Girl come on out. Mm-hmm. And I think they're lying about their age, too. Because, boy, some of these niggas look every bit of 38. Almost close to their 40s. Not saying, not saying that's nothing bad with that, but some of these niggas out here are looking a little older than what they are. And that's ridiculous within itself because you're young, just like me. Mm-mm-mm. Not saying that, you know, 40 and, and 38, I mean, 30, we know 30, what, 39 is old or nothing like that, but it's, it's up there. Okay, you didn't. Okay, you up there, but yeah, I'm just. I don't. I don't understand it. So many people want to put down the beef sector, like it's just, it's just the, the an, an evil place. Look, I'd rather people be in the beef sector than to be out here in this world. Really, in their own neighborhood, starting mess or getting into it with somebody out there, even though that's gonna be life. They gonna have. You gonna have incidents like that. But I'd rather them be at the house talking they ish. No matter if they're drunk or not. I'd rather them be at the house. You know? Instead of in the streets. Instead of in the streets. Have anybody thought about this? That the beef sector has kept a lot of folks out of trouble? That can probably get in some that that can probably get into some trouble? I'm just saying. Have anybody thought about that? Have anybody thought about that? Because I'm sure our little community, mm -hmm. if we didn't have it, what else would these people be doing? You know, don't get me wrong. It's, it's you know we 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 do have a majority of women that are viewing certain things, but it's a little men. It's, it's, it's a small percentage of men over here, but. It has saved a lot of people from getting into. It has saved a lot of people from getting into some some trouble. If you ask me, but you know what? Continue to continue to talk down 
on your own people. Continue to do the, look. Continue to continue to do that, as if you're just better and better and better and better. Like you're just behind the gates. I can't stand African Americans that act like they are just behind the gates, and even the ones that are behind the gates don't even act like that. Oh my goodness! But see, if the ones that may get a hold to a little money or a little attention, and all of a sudden they let that shit go to their head, and then they and then they also forget where, they, where the hell they came from. That's why I say dismiss, dismiss me, dismiss me with that bullshit. All them niggas out there. Mm-hmm. They got so much to say about the beef sector. Shout out to the beef sector. Shout out to the beef sector. It's known. A lot of, look, a lot of folks know us, know about us. Shout out to the beef sector. Even though I think the, the, its course has ran, well, maybe the beef sector has ran its course, but it is what it is. Nothing, nothing ever stays the same. Things are going to change. No matter how many years, <laughs> you know, that you have established something, it's going to change. And on that note, you guys, have a good day.